Hi guys. I was just going to use this radio control toy car steering section that I've used many times before and before I use it I thought I'd just do one of my toy car steering videos because it's a very simple one this I'll just see if I can operate it for you All we've got is this little peg that sticks out from the shaft of the motor and on the link rod here that goes across and connects up to the steering there's just a peg sticking up so that when this peg goes round it pushes against that peg inside. Can we see it? I'm not sure. I probably will have to take it apart completely so we can see it. But I just love this one, it's just so simple. I've managed to get that cover off, it's all clipped together, so it's a little bit awkward. But now we can see this rod, or connecting rod, that goes across and joins the steering up. So that's the little peg. That the peg on the motor pushes side to side. So if I can get that back in there again. Need to get it underneath that spring, that's the centering spring. The red one there. That's the one for adjusting the center position, or the center return position. So, can we get it back together again? That needs to go in there. <laughs> oh dear, dear. I don't like these ones that just clip together. I know it saves on screws and things, but they're a real pain when you're trying to mend them manually. Especially when you're trying to do it on camera. I don't think I've done it. Probably have to edit that a bit though. 
that's all in place. I can't remember what car this came from originally. But there we are, another radio control steering method. Just check it still works, now it's back together. Yep, that looks okay. <laughs>